Greetings, hey, it's Susie Q with another automatic written piece uh, through the Akashic Records. Something happened, I have no clue. I don't focus on what happened because it's in the past, but now we get to have maybe some guidance from some of my Akashic Records, so I'm super excited. Uh, we've got two that are gonna be partnering up together today, and we'll see what you think. So we'll get started right now. Doctor, doctor, give me the news. I got a bad case of loving you. Some lyrics come in like a wave sometimes. Maladies of the mind or heart or spirit bring about a tone of sickness for some. Ease and flow becomes dull, less enlivened, coarse, fragmented, sharp. Waves in the ocean impacted by the streams of what is happening now are fully immersed in what is. Energetic streams are one with the whole and sometimes are energy streams from source that are perfectly timed for this moment and now to be noticed. Body system shifts from one day to the next. Names we call it healthy, not healthy, good or bad, strong or weak, this or that, happy or sad. Ever feel like the little you in the sandbox throwing sand in the face of your best friend only to realize you threw the sand in your own face? The body you have is precious. As the song lyrics say, doctor, doctor, give me the news. I got a bad case of loving you. Might you consider that when or if your body system shifts into an expression of dis-ease or lower energetics that you see through new heart and new eyes. Be keen to your own Morse code of body system. New message taps you into awareness. It's okay to receive messages that come in. Receive in neutrality the message and begin to love that. Love that which is your own unique expression of now. Messages that come is your opportunity to do what you want. Like the message, okay. Not like the message, okay. <laughs> your choice. Robert Plant's lyrics hit, the, hit me early today. Envision your body system as the receiver and the doctor and the one you love. Love all there is if you choose love all parts of you, fall into love with a wholeness or brokenness, all serve you well. Like a patron at a restaurant, you are served what you ordered. Take the order, dine, and feast on what it is. And so if you choose, you may change your mind at any moment. Body system loves it when you do that. Smiles and love from those that adore you. <laughs> all right, pretty cheeky. All right, so we're going to go to the next one, and we're going to see what's what we're going to... I, don't, I haven't even read it, so I probably did it, I don't know, maybe a couple years. So this is another Akashic Record, working with automatic writing and getting perspective. So when we look at the Akashic Records, everything is there to help us. So when you look at lessons or divine purposes or things about the body, a lot of it's about the body. A lot of my material is about our physical apparatus, the body. All right, so we're going to go uh, for the next one. Tracing energies are sensory awarenesses of pure flow. Imagine feeling the touch of another who is not physically present. Breathe this in. I'm going to say it again. Imagine feeling the touch of another who is not physically present. Breathe that in. Meaning it could be spirit, right? Okay, from a holographic perspective, we can easily trace the sensory expressions. Divine light blends with the preciousness of pure energy. Think a thought, renew. Energies, more powerful than thought impressions or precognitive interpretations, awakens the centers of your breath of life. How to, some may say. <laughs> How to, some may say. Begin to whisper your radiance of love of self as a wavelength of energies that self-love harmonizes and balances your preciousness. Begin to engage and transform your now moment to being just being. Aside from the chatter of energies about 
realize and reorganize your ways of shifting your sense of love. How deep is this love? It's all there, it just is. A sea and ocean of love. You, in essence, are pure love. Forgetfulness arises to the depth of deeper love. Love as motion, love as gentling, love as cleansing, love as freedom, love as a strength, love as a vitality, love as a gift, love as a presence, love as a forgiveness, love as a healing, love as a dream, love as a harmonization, love as a remembrance, Love as a preciousness that freely brings this life into energies profoundly for all to receive. Tracing energies are the touch of the celestial presence so gentle and familiar. Tracing energies reminds of this goodness across all time and space. Forevermore we connect. Circulation and flow creates more circulation and flow. Grow. <laughs> All right, that was pretty fun. All right, so those are a couple pieces that I did. I don't know. I did it at some point. <laughs> so these written pieces are really kind of like, it's kind of like a beacon of what's next? You know, what else do I need to know? What else do I need to understand? What is happening with me? How can I have more understanding about my body? How I relate to messages of the body? Um, and how much love? How much love do I have the capacity to give love, to feel love, to feel loved myself, loving um, all of these experiences? When I think about love, you know, I always kind of like kind of uh, engage a little bit differently with what we call neutrality, you know, because sometimes people are like, well, they did me wrong or that was a stinker or I forgot something and I'm keeping holding on to, you know, some of the old stories is that it's really about, you know, releasing some of these energies. So when we're looking at love, you know, when we're really when we're really in our essence and our sweetness and our preciousness is that we really just know that that this love is always present. We came from love and then we when we leave we go with love that's how I see it you know when we go back into spirit all of these uh, energies are really supporting us and the more that we go into with my own Akashic records and maybe you've got guidance as well is that we start noticing that we're getting a little bit more guidance and a little bit more understanding about you know what it is to be here what it is to be here in this beautiful planetary school so when we're looking at more of this about love is that we really want to really really process it, it, at the very beginning is just pr start processing about your body and just having a better experience with your body a better understanding of your body a little bit more about you know the healing of the body and all of these uh, energies are ripe and ready to have a little bit more guidance so the more that we move into what we call the messenger system of the body we talk I talk about this a lot but that messenger system at the earliest onset of something happened you know maybe you know something happened suddenly in the body and it may, may not be a big deal but 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 if it's something is like some stagnant energy or frequency is dipped you can start working with the energy and you might just say, generally speaking, I'll maybe do some tapping or I might ask, I just, uh, let's go ahead and clear it. Let's go, let's go ahead and clear this stuff, you know? And so even when I'm walking, you know, I walk in sunny skies every morning. <laughs> People are like, who? Why does she keep walking around, walking around? But then we start looking at um, when something happens. Maybe I had something in a knee or a foot or my neck or I don't know my brain. Where's my brain? You know. Um, but we start working with clearing some of that. And I just ask. So let's just you know. So I will just start you know. And again, I don't say it out loud. I just it's just a thought construct. And and now I've been doing it for a long time. Is I just start just you know just I just I don't even have to say. Can you generally speaking help me or I just it just it just isn't an automatic right now for me. So I've been doing this for a while, this automatic energy to have a better experience with loving myself. The more that we love ourselves and the more that we are able to um, access deeper love with one another. And sometimes people might 
oh god well that well they did me wrong and all that you know is we just noticed that um it's okay it's okay for people to to be who they need to be and so i think that that energy what we're working with right now uh, with, the, with the work of uh, robert plant and some of those those beautiful lyrics and uh, with more of that love that love from the second piece all of that is uh, welcoming each one of us to just rise up you know rise up and really you know just really look at what is love what is love uh, in relationships what is love with your body what is love with the planet you know with your family your children i've got these grandkids and all these things are showing up but a lot of this is helping us and the more that we work with the body and the experiences of the body and healing the body is that we start we just start like vibrating love you know like maybe our auric field was maybe a little bit a um, little bit tight here but now all of a sudden it's like getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and then then it's like whoa you know so all of that love energy is just all showing up and it's super fantastic so we'll see you soon and namaste <laughs>